Welcome to the Walton Pi. Today we are going to go through another inductive proof. This time we are going to be looking at the sum from j equals 1 to n of 2j minus 1 and we will show that that is always equal to n squared. Now because this is a proof by induction we are going to have to start with a base case. Here our base case is going to be n equals 1. So if we look at the sum from j equals 1 to 1 of 2j minus 1 that's just going to be 2 times 1 minus 1, which is equal to 1, which is the same as 1 squared. So our base case holds. The next thing is we need to have our inductive hypothesis. So we will assume that for some k greater than or equal to 1, the sum from j equals 1 to k of 2j minus 1 is equal to k squared. We will now use this in our inductive step to show that it will also hold for k plus 1. The sum from j equals 1 to k plus 1 of 2j minus 1, we can pull out the k plus 1 term from there, and so we have a 2 times k plus 1 minus 1, plus the sum from j equals 1 to k of 2j minus 1. Since the sum from 1 to k of 2j minus 1 is just k squared, we are left with k squared plus 2k plus 1, which is the same thing as k plus 1 squared. Therefore, our inductive step has been successful and we have completed our proof that the sum from j equals 1 to n of 2j minus 1 is equal to n squared. If you found that this was helpful, please consider watching some of my other videos as well as liking and subscribing. I hope to see you again soon and good luck with all of your math!